So here we have a whole bunch of HEIC files, and you can see the HEIC designation over here in the file name, current file name. I've selected some that I want to export. Um, they're all HEIC files. If we then go to uh, File Export Here, we should see this. So we're putting them in a subfolder on the desktop. We are uh, renaming custom name sequence. And it's really important that the file settings here be JPEG, not original, right? The Lightroom can't export to an HEIC file. So if you're starting with that, you have to take it off of originals. It has to be on JPEG. In order to get the full size of the file, to make sure this is 100%. Right? We don't want to limit the file size at all, um, particularly if we're going to print something. And also don't check this resize to fit thing because we want to leave it as big as it can be. Um, the rest of this you can just ignore and then you should be able to export. I think the key here is really that this image format is JPEG uh, and not one of the other options. And I think we should be all set. If you want to save that setup for whatever reason, that will also save the put in subfolder thing. Um, you can add a preset over here. I have, I have one uh, that I use pretty regularly, um, but you could add that preset and call it whatever you want and add it to that user presets folder here uh, if you want to. We'll just go take a quick look and make sure that here are, they're not charcoal, but these are the pictures that I just exported and they are now JPEGs, Happy Camper JPEGs at a pretty decent size for my phone. Yay. Okay, so that should do it. Let's give it a shot.